Hello guys, so welcome to KO Tutorials. So let's continue with the next part of this tutorial. So let's get started. So over here we'll complete the texturing part for this particular interior over here today. So now what we can do over here is like the things which are left out will be completing that. So let's just select this wall part over here and let's just give the same texture over here so we can just assign the same texture so we'll assign the same texture over here and let's give a UVW map and let's just set it as a box so select this I'll go into this and I'll just after that we'll select this element and we have a metal material already assigned we'll just assign that material over here for this let's assign this material after that let's go over here we'll select this part go into the material editor again and will assign a ceramic material so I have a ceramic material so let's just take a V-ray material over here let's go into diffuse and let's take a ceramic material over here so I have downloaded so I'll just take this ceramic material give a UVW map and I'll set this and I'll fit this over here go into this let's go into reflect and give a bit of reflection to this ceramic material so select this part over here so let's just select this area and let's again go into material and let's give a glass material over here let's go into refract I'll increase the IOR I'll just give a glass over here after that so just name it as glass over here okay I think it's a glass only it's a glass so control I that's for inverse selection I'll go into this and I'll give a V-ray material I'll go into this and I'll just pick a color I'll make it a bit lighter go into reflect slightly and So end isolate this over here select this part go into material again give a V-ray material and I have a photo frame over here I will be taking this photo frame inverse selection v-ray material 
and for photo frame I have assigned a texture I can say a shader a bit of a reflective shader so let's go into diffuse I'll make it a bit of white give a bit of reflection increase this and reduce this and just assign that looks much better now after that select this part and we'll just assign this as a normal black color that will do over here for that same would go with this also over here so I'll just select this polygons over here I'll go into the material assign that let's give a bit of reflection control I inverse take again a V-ray material and give a black color to it alright so we we'll just give a brownish dark brownish color now what we are going to do over here is like uh, we have this vent, vent left over here for this just select this go into material I'll go into the diffuse and I'll just pick a color I'll slightly move towards white shape I'll slightly give a bit of reflection and if required I'll again go over here I'll take a noise and I'll just connect it with a bump map so make it as fractal okay I think looks much better so convert to editable poly select this all just convert to editable poly now again over here so I think we have textured the whole area alright alright so guys if any doubts please put it in the comment section over here as you can see over here we have completed with the texturing part for this particular interior so in the coming tutorial I'll start up with the lighting part so please like and subscribe my youtube channel so if any doubts please put it in the comment section so we'll continue the rest of the part in the coming tutorial so thanks for watching this tutorial.